Hello, friends and lovers. I bet you thought I was done with Bingle Bingle, didn't you? Bingle Bingle, but I'm not. It was fun. It was actually really, really fun. If you missed the first video, I highly recommend you check that out because I'll explain it a lot better, hopefully, in detail there. But it is a complex game. Uh, so we're just going to hop into it a little bit faster this time. We're going to take out the Trickster instead of the Archer. So kind of like three different starting decks. Trickster, buying three marked items in the shop gives you a random effect. Unused round tokens are saved for up to three for the next round. And you gain money per unused discard instead of regular tokens this time. Hope that makes sense. We also get minus one round token plus one discard. We don't want to use our discards, basically. Gain a rare item. Get 20% less score for first three rounds. Three tokens are upgraded. These tokens cost plus one coin to be upgraded. Replace a normal token with a random token with an alpha perk. Zero discards for the first three rounds. So something could kind of dictate which way we go here. It's up to us how we want to do it. What is alpha token again? perk? I don't I don't remember what. Let's get a random one. So the alpha perk means that we always start with this. So we start with a multi ball with golden street bet. So street means we bet on three numbers. We also earn money if we actually win the bet. That's kind of hard to do. Um, Yeah, so we have no discards, but that's okay. We do lose money, though. Should I even be placing this bet, or is it simply too hard? I guess I'm just going to throw the balls. Which means we're only going to score... Actually, I think you just score... Oh, wait, no, but the multi-ball is not worth a lot. So we get that three times, so we only get 150, basically. So that's definitely not great. We're still guaranteed to win. There's no point in placing a bet now, because no matter what, it's going to take two more tokens to get out of here. Is it only the first round that we have no discards? I already forgot. Golden Street. Golden Street bet. I'm going to have to look at that a little bit harder. To remind myself exactly what it means. Because I kind of can't look at it here. During the roulette wheel. What doth it mean? Bet on three numbers horizontally. When winning this bet. 50% chance to trigger golden. Which means plus three coins. Fragile plus 80 chips. Multi-ball. Roll three balls. Fragile. And it has the alpha token. Attached token is always drawn first in each shuffle. So we probably. We want it to be a good bet them we want to skew around winning this bet for the rest of the run basically <laughs> i think but on three numbers horizontally so we want to change a bunch of numbers to all the same so i guess we got a triple 25 so maybe that's what we're going for whatever 25 lines up with here 25 26 and 27 we want to have 25 so just change anything that's not 25 26 and 27 to those numbers i suppose huh right away and that right now we're already broken i can't find anything else we bought one mask which i believe fills this in and when we buy a third one we get a random item so you do, you want to target the items there i guess for that if possible so let's place our golden street 25 26 and 27 roll our normal ball and off we go and of course i lose the bet no surprise there <laughs> I should probably be placing two bets. Or should I? I don't know. I don't know. We can't discard. There's no point in discarding anyway. We lost our bet again. Is it over already? Yeah, Golden Street is a bit spicy. Discards wouldn't really help. Oh, we landed on 25. Still in it then. Yeah, we're going to need to change that very quickly. No doubt about it. It really was not worth that much either. <laughs> a, we got a lot of work to do here. 25, 26, 27. We didn't get those numbers. And you could change that. You can also upgrade the multi ball. Roll a ball, the next ball will go into the same pocket. Hmm. More multi balls might be good for throwing to try to hit the, the bet correctly, right? But we always want to place that bet. Let's upgrade it so it scores better. And we picked up another multi-ball to try to actually land in it. Because the, the, I guess that's our focus right now is to win this bet. As often as possible. We still have no rolls. No discards, I should say. I can't force the multi-ball. 
You lost the bet? Okay, though. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. This time, though. It's a 16. We lost the bet. <laughs> okay. But here's the multi-ball. One of them has to land on it. Come on. It's guaranteed, right? Oh, we got a 26. Okay, we're cool. They all get counted separately. So that one won the bet. We still barely did it. We still barely did it. Oh, two of them won the bet. Oh, that one's 27, I just realized. And we got the money from it. Oh, okay. They're edging us right now. We got a 27 in there. That's nice. Heart ball, roll ball at the roll ball. If the ball doesn't win any bet, instead of scoring, gain a round token back. That's actually quite nice for us. Huh? First page of each shop, every products are pockets. First re-roll is always free. I like that too. There's also a 27 here. Hmm. So we definitely want the heart ball. That's very, very good for us. Can we afford to take all pockets as an investment? I sure hope so. When the ball lands in a pocket containing the number four, gain plus two discards. Hmm, that's not good for us, but whatever. So that's our first random item from whatever this mask was called. The trickster, maybe? I reckon. First boss, freeze three random pockets after using a token. 25, 26, 27. They froze a 25. Uh-oh. So do we want to discard? I know it costs us money. I think we do. Do I want to place more bets? 25, 26, 27. You'd bet on odds, huh? I don't think I want to place another bet. Let's throw the heart ball for sure. Landing on a 10. We get the token back at least. But it is freezing more crap here. I guess I'd like to throw the multi ball before it freezes too many pockets. Hmm, we did not land any for the bet. That's really bad. <laughs> That's incredibly bad, one might say. Can we get past the first boss here, we think? Oh, no. Is this, was this one our last chance? We got a 25. Is that enough, though? From a normal ball? I don't know. It is enough. Wow. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. We get to live. Natural selection. Every round your first used token is registered. Your one round using only the registered token. Your first used token is registered. Clear one round using only the registered token. Huh. Clear four rounds with spinning at least four times. That's actually not bad for us. Destroy 12 tokens. So probably fragile. Yeah, fragile. That's actually good, but 12 is a lot. I still think that's quite good for us, right? At 25% of points and chips from each destroyed token. I think that's good for us. Okay, what the heck are we doing here? 25, 26, and 27. There's a 26. Okay. 25, 26, 27... None of those otherwise. No 25, 26, 27. Okay. All right. Plus 16 points. Decrease it by two by... Decrease it by two permanently when money is spent. I see. When winning a column bet, plus 15 points. No. Cash token is always drawn first in each shuffle. No. Hmm. This makes the bet better. Heart ball. Hmm. Four is better. Bet on a vertical line. Bet on six numbers horizontally. Hmm. We don't want to discard, so we kind of just want more balls. We don't really want pocket ball. Don't have a lot of money, though. 
Let's level up the super ball. Maybe the heart ball was better because I'm going to throw that every time, really. Okay. Yeah, so the quest did go up by one. Super ball. So it's kind of just a plain old ball, but has a lot of points, huh? I see. We lost a bet. That's not so bad. Multi-ball go. We just leveled that. I see 127. Is that enough? I don't think so. I wish the score went up a little bit faster. I know I had the speed up button, but then like everything kind of goes too fast with that. I need an intermediate number or something. It was not that many. We did get some money out of it though. There's the heart ball. We would definitely want to chuck that. Please win the bet. Oh, it did. Yay. Is that enough now? We donezo? We're donezo. Okay. We're definitely fighting for our life here. Golden street bets. We got lots of money. 25, 26, 27. Mind me just saying the number out loud again. There's a 26. Don't really care which one I replace, I think. Making sure I'm not missing anything else. None of those there. Been on one number? I don't think so. Wave ball I don't hate. After buying or upgrading less than twice in the shop, gain 10% more score permanently. Uh, seven and six. Head on one vertical line. I don't like that, Pat. 13. I'm looking at the cost here, and it's kind of just awkward amounts here. If I want to get keep the change and wave ball, maybe I don't get keep the change then. Six. One, two, three. Okay, let's get wave ball. And then we'll upgrade all three. We're going to spread the love and have a bunch of useful balls this time. Hopefully. <laughs> I should probably upgrade our main ball for the bet here, though. 25, 26, 27. We're going to discard the normal ball. Throw out the heart ball. Yeah, we need this bet to be worth more. There we go. We're moving along in our quest. Nice. Worth 26. First try. Let's go, baby. Liking this heart ball right now. It's good for high risk. Uh, bets like what we have. None of the pockets that we want. Roll it. Still none of the pockets that we want. Bet on 1 through 18 or 19 through 36. When winning this bet, have the chance to trigger golden. No, I don't think so. Another wave ball. I think we saved the last slot. We could go multi-ball. But maybe I want... I don't know. Cash token, roll one more ball. Or bet once more. Token is worth half value. Hmm. When winning a split bet, plus 35 points. We don't do split bets. When number of round tokens left is even... Plus 20 chips. When it's odd, plus 5 chips. I mean, there's no downside to that. And there's nothing else I desire that much. So let's do that. We place our bet. Wave ball is fine. The more we throw it, the more powerful it gets. We didn't win the bet. No biggie, though. God, that was worth nothing. <laughs> Come on, Super Ball. I don't think I want to discard it. Yo! That's good. It should be worth a lot, I think. 57 hundo. Let's go, baby. Okay. None of the pockets we need still. Scary. 25, 26, 27 we want. Bet on a pack of a dozen numbers. Could place more than one bet. Plus one point per the count of numbers you have removed from the wheel. One, two, three, four, five already? It's not bad. I think we kind of like it. We got the large ball, pocket ball, alpha token. Hmm... Mm-hmm. That costs nine. I think we do the do this, right? 
I think we do because we want to change any, everything to 25, 26, 27. It does leave us at a kind of an awkward amount, admittedly, but I guess I'll change something's bet. What is something I don't want to roll? This other multi ball is kind of weak. I think I'd rather roll pretty much everything else. Well, obviously not the normal ball, but I guess I'm planning to replace that. Strong Claw from the second bet. That will only have 20% chips. That's actually fine for us. Since we really don't want to place bets here. I will throw this out here, even though it's... Especially if we lose the bet, it's worth dick. Just to grow the wave ball stronger, right? Doom, 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 doom. Wow, okay. That went very smoothly already. I'm going to say we won. Actually, if we lose this bet, this isn't worth anything. Oh, we still won! Let's go. I should have I should have discarded. Get the get the quest going more rapidly, I'm gonna say. We're doing pretty good though. Permafrost frees four pockets. No. Remove one token from the deck. Maybe. You can play one more token per round. Token burner, huh? <coughs> you can get rid of that normal. But it doesn't really help us in most ways. Yeah, I think you could just play one more token, I think. I think that's going to be better. 25, 26, 27 we want. There's a 26. There's a 27. That costs 7. That's a, that's a good one. Okay. Oh, we got a free thing. When the ball ends in a pocket 8, the next ball is rolled once more. In a pocket eight or pocket that contains an eight? In a pocket eight. 25, 26, 27. We're getting there. Okay. No, no. Oh, I want the heart ball. We can actually lock it. I think we do. I really like the heart ball here. Awkward numbers, though. Corner bed is okay. If I upgrade this ball and then I replace it, does that work? I guess we'll find out. Might not want to throw... Hmm. I don't know. You always throw the heart ball. I guess in theory I might not throw the super ball then. Let's lock it in. Let's see. If you replace the ball, will it... I get think it might retain the upgrade. Not sure. 25, 26, 27. Discard that one. Chuck the multi ball, sure. This way it breaks for the quest. Only one bet one here. <clears throat> I don't want to use too many discards because we want to conserve money, of course, right? We do want to throw the wave ball, though, to make that grow. We lost the bet, but that's okay. Wave ball go up, at least. Super ball. I got discards. Why did I get discards again? Something gives me discards, I think. Oh, if you hit a four. Okay, well, what's going on? Can we just win the bet? I wasn't looking for a minute. We lost a bet, so we get it back. Throw the wave ball again. Hey, we're growing the wave ball, at least. Hey, we landed in at 27. So that's going to score pretty well, I think. We got to make that bet stronger. That should be a bigger priority, probably. 25, 26, 27. Don't forget those numbers. Nothing. We roll it. There's our hop, heart ball back. Yes. So it retains the levels. I guess we kind of knew that. When the highest level token is not used for a round, mean 15% more score permanently. Oh, that is interesting. The ball didn't win any bet. The next ball gets plus 30 points. That's not bad for us, right? Can we agree? 
But is it right? I don't know. Hmm. Considering we're like a one bet pony. It is interesting. We're going to level that, I think. Next ball, huh? What do we want to level next after that? Wave ball? Maybe. Can't conserve money. Then on six numbers horizontally. Wave ball now to make it gross better. Guess I'll throw a bet onto something here. A better bet than even odd, right? 25, 26, 27. I kind of don't want to use Super Ball, right? I either want to use the Heart Ball in case we don't win the bet or the Wave Ball so that it grows. As I understand it, right? I think that's what we want to do. Hmm. Multi Ball also stinks. I know I lose money by rolling there. Do, 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 do. How's our bet coming along here? Maybe I should have done something. Yeah, I probably should have placed a bet instead of discarding. Yeah, there's no harm in placing the bet, really, with this deck as much. There is harm, but there's less harm. Nice, a triple 27. That's nice. Yeah, I should be placing more bets, shouldn't I? Triple 27 in there. Let's go, baby. 25, 26, 27. So we're kind of done with our balls, right? Definitely not that one. No. I don't think we want any of that. Hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I think we just upgrade that. Do that too. Sure. Make the first bet very strong, I guess. 25, 26, 27. Definitely throw the wave ball. Winning bet. Might not be enough. I don't know. It's still pretty good. Chuck the heart ball. Because you can't lose with that. I don't want to throw the multi ball that we have. We might want to replace that. Maybe another heart ball. Maybe something that earns us money somehow, if possible. We shall she. No 25, 26, or 27. So we roll. We got. Wow, look at that. 25, 26, 27. We're getting there. Cash token is always drawn last in the shuffle. It's worth 1.5 in value. Super Ball? Could give it to the Super Ball. Do I care about that? Maybe not that much. When round tokens run out, revive with three additional. When the ball ends any pocket, blah, 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 plus 40 chips. No. Hmm. Just upgrade the Wave Ball, maybe? Always drawn last. Token is worth 1.5. Hmm. It is interesting. I think I'm just going to upgrade the wave ball, though. Add five basic tokens into your tokens for this round. It's definitely not good. There's now 20, 25, 26, 27s in there. I should have just... Yeah, we should probably just place a bet. Apparently, we have a lot more odds. There's a heart ball. Throw that out. Okay, very nice. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I'd rather place a bet than to discard. Same thing. 
Another heart ball. Let's go. 27. Beautiful. Didn't get to throw the wave ball. What can you do, though? Mm -mm. Okay, what do we got? Plus three more discards per round. So that could equate to money for us. Can play one more token. Remove one token from the deck. I guess we're getting discards. You can always use them too, right? We got a bunch of 25s in here. Well, I got two 25s to be precise. <laughs> there we go. Roll it. We got a 27. Hard to read it upside down like that. <laughs> what do you got here? Game one discard when you draw heart ball after discarding. Huh. Plus 30 chips per the numbers with both red and black pockets. It's really just those three. Will we would get plus 90 chips? It's not bad. Uh, it's interesting. I'll have three chips left. I uh, sorry, three dollars left over. What can I do with those three dollars? Not a whole lot. Not a whole lot. Yeah, I guess we. I guess I'm just gonna upgrade that. This doesn't seem necessary. Otherwise, we have twenty-three of these numbers. We definitely want to throw the wave ball in particular. In fact, I might want to make sure we, that we always get to throw the wave ball so that it keeps growing. It should be worth quite a bit, I think. Ooh, maybe not that much. We have a ton of discards now. Place more bets out here. Or the super ball, see what we get for that. It's not worth as much as the wave ball. Uh, landed on a 20, unfortunately, for us. So we lost a bet. It was worth a dick. <laughs> That's a bad one. Alright, let's throw the heart ball, I guess. Don't screw me. Okay, you didn't. Should be worth a decent amount. Okay. Do we want to discard for the wave ball again? Yes, I do. Trying to conserve some tokens. Oh, come on! It hit 16 on us. Starting to get low here. Definitely don't want to use the multi-ball. Super ball. Come on. Help me. Alright. I think we're good. I'm going to guess we're good now, finally. Please tell me we're good. We're out. Ugh. Okay. Mm -mm. Gotta manipulate it. 25, 26, 27, nothing. Roll it. Singular 25. Okay. Did we get a free item? Didn't look that way. Did it do something? Something shined. Echo bets are worth more. At each round, get a temporary token plus one level higher than currency level. Tokens worth one half value. I don't like that. Yeah, this is bad, right? What's the best way to spend our money here? Oh! Everything got discounted. Oh, okay. Oh. I don't think I like most of these. Attach token roll once, one more ball, or bet once more. Token is worth half value. Maybe we give that to the multi-ball for a better bet. What do you think? Cost eight puts us down to nine. Spend that. Don't really want to change any of that. I guess I upgrade the wave ball. Super ball. 14, 17. Okay, we've been on those. Okay. Got the wave ball. 
Nice. Hit the 26. Perfect. Hey, it's finally over. Fragile Legacy. At 25% of points and chips from each destroyed something or another. Still not over, though. Three points, 100 chips. Place that bet. Throw a heart ball. Lots of dozen bets here. Could change those to more street bets. That'd be nice, right? All the bets are won. I would speed it up, but I feel like it's actually too fast when you speed up the animations, by the way. Oh, damn. We gotta do it again. Really thought we would have had enough. Heart ball went kapoof. Is this, like, permanently? Kind of? Fragile legacy? Maybe. Is, or is it, like, per round? It appears to keep going up. 25, 26, 27 we need. Nope. Bet on one number. We have 11, 25. So you could do that. Then on two numbers, this bet reduces the chips, but has mirror. At the normal version, the same bet that worth 1.5 times on a random place. Oh, that's terrible, right? So you'd bet against two numbers? Hmm. Always drawn first. Is there another one we always want to use to bet first? Corner is worth 90 chips. Dozen is worth 45. So the corner bet is better here. Plus 10 points decrease it by one per count of unused round tokens at the end of the round permanently. No. When the ball lands in pocket 6 or 28. Gain more score. No. So. Line bet, huh? Bad. Um, okay. You have a lot of money. No doubt about. Do I really want to bet on, like, one number? 25? Can we be that risky? So we're always going to draw this soon as well. What did I give you? Double token. That makes your bet stronger. Multi-ball bet stronger. Okay. Hmm. Do I want to change your bet style now? I don't know. Twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven. 26, 27. I don't think I want to bet on one number. I think it's too risky. Kind of don't fully understand the mirror split. <laughs> These are not useful. Okay. Scared. We want to make these bets stronger, I suppose. More likely to roll this one than and use that one as a bet, I suppose. Onward. Place our bets. Place that on the corner here. Just that. Mm, 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 mm. And place that bet too. We're gonna place that bet too. <laughs> Eventually, I'll get to roll a ball here. Guess I'm gonna roll the heart. We hit 27, which wins all bets, I believe. Now this this actually went down a little bit. 34k. Yeah, this was what I was waiting for the wave ball. But I want to start discarding just to draw the wave ball to make it stronger maybe if this doesn't score too hard did not yeah i'll just place my bet with that one this one's fragile if oh but only if you roll it okay forget it discard there's the wave ball again I know I'm losing a little bit of money here by discarding, but. Go, 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 go. Yeah, I only can serve one token here. Wave ball worth 93,000 though. It's getting there. 
Doom, bam, ba doom, 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 doom. Oh yeah, we do conserve some money. I kind of forgot with this particular deck. I wish I remembered. We got a lot of the numbers we want. 25, 26, 27. Right? There's a 26. 25, 26, 27. All right, we're almost there. I'm converting like the entire board practically. Bet on a pack of 12 numbers. Uh, is that better than corner? No. Hmm. Attached token becomes fragile. Could give that to uh, nothing really. Definitely don't want to give it to the wave ball. For each different bet gain, 15% more score. That's pretty good for us. Don't know what a flash bet is. Yeah, we have a few different bets. One, two. Bet a horizontal line, right? Yeah. Actually, we like that bet. So we're likely to do one, two, three bets at least. I think that's not bad. Okay, let's go. Another boss. Distracted from the second ball. Only score 70%. Uh-oh. Oh, so this has more now. So let's bet on those. Definitely bet on a line here. Bet on a dozen. There's the wave ball. Let's throw it. Nice, we won all of our bets. Might not be enough here, though. I don't know. I'm kind of okay if it's not, I guess. Oh, it was just enough! We got out of the air. Copy a token from your deck. That could be really strong, right? So we get rid of... I don't know. You probably copy the wave ball, right? Or do you copy the bet? Maybe you copy the good bet. Yeah, because that way we just place two strong bets right away. We don't really need two wave balls. We need better, stronger bets, probably. Because this is always going to be drawn first. Okay, that's really good. 25, 26, 27. Y'all remember the numbers? Hmm. But on three numbers horizontally, another golden street bet. So we can change this one, this bet, to that. It's definitely worth it. We're not diversified in that way, but that's okay. Cash token becomes fragile. Heart ball. Do I want to change something like multi ball to that? Not really. Wave ball also increases chips of bet it won permanently. How much? Yo, how much? <laughs> I was so aggressive about it. Didn't win any bet. The next ball gets plus 30 points. You like the wave ball. Okay. I know it's an awkward amount of money. Hmm. That's okay, I suppose. You need 300,000. Street bet. Street bet. Why is that bet worth so much less? Oh, probably because it's just not upgraded as much. Oh, this is the one that's upgraded a lot. Wait. Uh, now I don't know. Now I don't know. Here's our wave ball. Chuck it! Freeze the chips permanently. Mm, 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 mm. 249k. You know, that's alright. I'm gonna discard some here. Get the wave ball again. Come on. Increase those base points, right? Mm. 
Well, yeah, why was one of these street bats so bad? Did I just not level it that much? Maybe. Bing, 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 bing. Money, money. Golden Street gave us 15. Wow. No 25, 26, 27. Oh! Triple dipples. There's very few that don't have that. We could change something to a wave ball if we want. Is it too late to grow something else? Always run last news shuffle. Give that to the wave ball? That way we would place a bunch of other bets. Wave ball's base points are increased once per spin. Every time the ball is rolled, increase its base points by 11. Increase once per spin. Uh, I'm kind of confused. Give that to the wave ball. Are you the street ball, the, the golden street pet that's worth less? Yes, you are. Okay. I understand it. Don't understand that one, though. Isn't that already what it does? But I guess we are kind of just using the wave ball, so I guess I'm going to do it. Six numbers horizontally. We can conserve our money, I think. 350k they want. It's your bet, sir. Okay. Yeah, just keep betting. As soon as that wave ball shows up. There she is. 188. Is it me or did that shoot up? Increase. I went up like a lot, right? 241? Didn't have to use any discards. Oh! Oh, it's disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Shameful, really. Okay. There's a 26. I see another 26, too. There are some left. 26. I think there's just this 116 left. Yep. <laughs> okay, very nice. So just one left. And hey, what do you know? So maybe we don't need to buy that. <laughs> They're buying or upgrading less than twice in the shop, gain 10% more score permanently. Eh. Vertical line, no. We have $17. Hmm. What's the best bang for our buck here? 100 chips from that. 80 chips from that. Probably just upgrading two things here. Line bet goes up by 50. That goes up by 40. This bet goes up by 40. So it's going to be that, I believe, right? Rizzy roll. Let's get our bets out here, shall we? It was kind of dicey at the start, right? It was. I swear it was. <laughs> Maybe I should throw one discard out of here. Just so we can serve a few more tokens. It almost landed on that 16. You see that? Go wave ball. Bing, 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 bing. 798,000, baby. Keep it going. We're doing good. We can replace the final number. Can I find it on the board? Boom. It's over. So we don't need to consider that anymore, really. Hmm. Cash token gives coin equal to its level when discarded. Uh, that feels weird. When winning a corner bet, plus 25 points. When the ball ends in a pocket containing number seven, gain a dollar. Definitely not. I think we're just upgrading our balls now, kind of, right? No jokes, please. A 13 and a nine bet. 
I guess it feels like it's kind of late to upgrade the wave ball a little bit. Oh, actually, it just increases the base points anyway. It doesn't make it grow faster, right? Every time the ball is rolled, it increases its base points by 11. That would stay the same. Oh, wow, we actually maxed one out here. Oppression can only score up to one to third of target score at once. Okay. We should discard the lousier bets here. So that means we have to roll at least three times. This might be the final boss. I'm not sure, though. That's one, baby. How's this doing? Yo, Fragile Legacy. Kind of pop them. 25% of points in chips. Yeah, so we did actually beat it in one, but the boss won't let us win in one here. <laughs> Why don't we throw the multi-ball just to get it out of here so we won't keep drawing it? Look at them all. Will that score well? I don't even know. Hard for me to tell. This is a bunch of balls. It looks like it's scoring pretty well to me. <laughs> Dang. Look at them all. Bunch of multi-balls would be cool, huh? It's actually better than the wave ball. That's wild. But of course, it's only 400k in this instance. There's the wave ball. 287 base points on it. All right, how do we do? Big base points. Big everything. 735k. Game clear! Whoa! Click to continue to challenge mode. Oh, so we're still not over. Endless mode has begun, it looks. You only can play one more token per round, remove a token from the deck, three more discards per round. I think the steak raise is better here. We don't need more discards, right? But how do we get stronger here? Convert everything into one number exactly? Step one. We have more 27s than anything. So I guess we're aiming for 27s if they appear. Otherwise, we can roll past it. Then on two numbers. Hmm. More wave ball. How quickly are we going to lose here, I wonder? Ball lands in these pockets. That's not good. Huh. We have a lot of money. Yeah, we could make our bets a lot stronger. Then on four numbers in a square. Hmm. Always drawn first. That's no longer necessary. Because we have the wave ball going last already. In fact, we don't need the alpha on any of these anymore. Fascinating. Fascinating. We don't, right? As far as I understand it. Mm, 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 mm. You're maxed. We might as well max out the wave ball now then. While we're gonna... The way we're gonna be playing it. After balls get scored, the score from a ball of the same type only scores 50%. They want mil, 1 million now. We're immediately fighting another boss, huh? So I guess we're just going to place all the bets. And then we're going to roll it, right? Let's see how we do. Boom, boom, boom. 327 base points on the wave ball. What do you got? 25. We won all the bets. Up, 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 up. How do we do? Oh, we broke a million. Damn it. Let's go. So we only want, we want to try to convert everything into 27. Very, very slowly, no doubt. Hmm. Bet on two numbers. Flash, frat, what does flash mean? We're three times the normal version of the same bet. Bet is removed after spin. But we can only bet on two numbers. 
Oh, when the highest level token is not used for a round. No. Winning a line bet. No. That does sound good. Fragile, huh? That is removed after a spin. Hmm. Guess I'm gonna take it for now. If we think that it's probably not a big deal. When multiple balls are rolled at once, only one ball gets scored. It's actually fine for us, right? We're going to take it for now under the premise that we will eventually get that far, but we probably won't look at things. Flash split. So those two numbers are the best. Whether or not we actually land on those is another question. Mm -mm. I should probably be rolling the shop now, huh? Well, we're trying to upgrade the balls too, I guess. Is the thought. Did we hit the flash split? We did. How come we got two of them? No complaints, I guess. We barely got out of that one. Huh, why did we get two? 27s we want. That's all we want. Nope. Bet on three numbers horizontally. That's much better than the other bets. We should take that. Dozen or line. Line is worth more. Let's do that. We want to roll the shop now. Bet on two numbers. Hmm. Attach token, roll once more, or bet once more. Oh, that's why that one worked. So we can give that to... This perk is quite strong. We can give that to that so we get the double bet from it. Will let me place that many bets? I don't know. Actually not sure. Level that up to make the bet stronger. So it's just boss after boss. Maybe 5 million special bets turns into normal bet for this round. Well, luckily we don't have tons of special bets. We Well, we have like the golden street. We don't need golden though. Right? Split that. Wait, what is that? What? So that's a line bet. Should I just discard it? Will it not let me place that many bets? I'm actually not sure. The flat min not getting flash is bad. We won all the bets. Fragile legacy doesn't work in this circumstance, which is very bad. Yeah, that was only worth a million. What happens if I start placing more bets? Okay, the, you can have more bets. I actually was not sure about that. We skipped the line. It's not worth as much. That one's also not worth as much. Split bet is worth a little bit more. But it looks like we lost. Because <laughs> I can only roll once more here. Could I have discarded enough to row that many times? I don't know. Yeah, getting no fragile, no tokens broken kind of hurt us here. Because we don't get to multiply the score enough. 2.3 million. Maybe I, we could have won it if I hadn't <laughs> placed so many bets at the end there. But hey, we had a fun run, right? That was good. There we go. Max challenge round. It was two high score, 3.4 million. Bingle, bingle. It's still pretty good, right? It was actually fun. There's a lot of different ways to play it, I think, actually, in, in terms of the balls and everything. Hope you all enjoyed it. If you want to see more, make sure you let me know. Thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.